Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Game on, where we just keep on gaming on. I'm Lucky, we got more Dragon's Dogma 2 for you. So, we're about to fight this griffin we found out in the middle of nowhere here. The forested griffin's nest. I mean, I don't even know if we can jump down there. <gasps> Seeker's token, thank God, I've been looking for one forever. I don't even know if we can really get down there without dying, like our health is so low. Like, what do we do? Can you guys just hit it with magic from up here? Oh, there's there's a port crystal right there, guys. We have to beat this thing. Do not to Come on. Ah. I can ensnare it, <laughs> but it doesn't do anything, does it? He's just like, whatever. Just wait for him to come down. He'll come down. He'll come down. Just let everybody get him with his offensive magic. Come on. There he is. That was our chance. One thing we don't want to do really is I like, don't want to jump up on him. Gosh, I wish this camera would stop like doing its thing there. Kabuki! Oh, he's tough. He's real tough. I mean, that was like hardly any damage at all. I guess we're going down here. Let's go, guys. No way. Okay. I thought he got down there, so it would be okay. But let's use a wake stone. Yes, and that brings me back to full health. That's what I wanted. And I had a bunch of those wake stones. Whoops. So, of course, we're going to grab those items real quick, guys, before we try to finish this fight. Oof. Oof. It's hard reviving your pawns in this game compared to the last one. The last one, it was so much easier. Port crystal. Okay, so we got the important item. There's a soothing brew here too, but I'm not too concerned about that. Sorry, Kabuki. Try to kind of grind him out here while I got a second. Every time he tries to turn on us. There we go. Man, he is really hard, guys. Look at how burly he is. He even looks a little bit different, doesn't he? Put a light show on fire just like that. Look at that. That really rocked him. He didn't like that at all. Okay. Um... There you go, he's stunned now. First time we've seen a rock like that. There we go. That might be a little on fire. That's what we gotta do, guys. We just gotta light his ass up. So we'll get him like this. Turn his head, just like this guy is. That's a better idea than that. Kabuki. He's gonna get back up. So we got two of his health bars down. That was savage. Get him, Kabuki. I don't think he's gonna run off either because we're in his nest. Whoa, watch out. Can I for anything from him? But I picked that up off the ground, I think, though. I don't know, I'm trying to pilfer, but I can't. Let me pilfer his ass. Huh. Okay, you know what? 
Oh, that was the wrong move. I ran right into where it was hitting me. Oh, that lightning damage is getting his getting his wings clipped. Oh, I guess not. I guess not. Hey, we got this guy though. We'll get him. Definitely get out of the way. Come on. You guys go get him. Get him. Yeah. As soon as he comes at me, I'm dashing. Where are you going, buddy? Come here. Come on now. But the snare's not working that far away. Lightning attacks and damage. When a lightning attack is unleashed, the magical energy cannot be contained. Bolts of lightning will branch off and jump to targets in the vicinity, dealing additional damage. Moreover, if a drenched target is struck with lightning attack, the resulting bolts will be able to reach a wider range. Wow. Who got attacked with the lightning? Was it uh, the Griffin that shot us with the lightning? What's going on with the lightning? Whoa. Whoa. Come on. So this will go bad really fast here. Put him down. Put him down. It's like a storm brewing from this battle. Everybody get back up here. Come on. Including you. Come on. Come on. Come down here. Oh, look at him hit the side of the cliff right there. This guy is savage, dude. This forest of Griffin is crazy. Let's pick up the Griffin opinion while we're right here. Come on. Come on, Griffin. That's why you gotta have some ranged attacks, guys. I mean, if we did, he'd probably just run off. Fighting the Griffin on the cliff side. I better heal because kind of risky business like that. By far the hardest Griffin so far in the game. Come on, everybody get up here. Don't be down there. Make him come back up here and fight us in this mess. That was savage. Come on. Okay, now he's going crazy. He's so mad. Damn, man. His whole flight flight mechanics are just wild. Kabuki, come back here. He'll come back. There he is. Oof. Man, once he gets to this stage, we gotta have some magic here or something. once he takes flight, so he'll definitely take flight. Yeah, there you go, see? I'm gonna jump off here. Oh no. I got hit mid-air with lightning? That's some bullshit. 
Oh yeah, well let's use the second wake stone here. What, is he stuck or something? Because we've been at it for about 10 minutes now. Here he comes. Light him up. That's, that's what we gotta get him. Just like that. Everybody all at once. Everything we got. Boom. Look at that. Alright, now he's down. Now we've got him. So they get on top of him. I don't know guys, this could be it right here. We're gonna get this boy to stick gripping. We're gonna get him. Not yet, not yet. We got one more round, I think. We got one more round to stick gripping. Look at Kabuki. Look at him go. Good job, Kabuki. Light him up. Light him up. There it is. There it is. There it is. Oh, 7,100 experience, guys. 197 of those death points. And we gained a level. Fuck yeah, that's what I'm talking about. We got a Griffin Pinion, Great Griffin Claw. And that was an epic fight. That was like over 10 minutes right there. there are useful ingredients and brilliant, too. Roll, Onyx, Would Gold, Tiger Eye, 2,500 2, Fairy Stone, 2,800. Wow, so that's 6,000, 7,500 gold here. Plus a Fairy Stone, a Port Crystal, a bunch of Griffin Pinions, Miasmite, Onyx. There was a bunch of good stuff here, guys. Holy cow. So that is the Forested Griffin boss fight. That is definitely a mini boss out here in the Great Wide Open. That was so cool. You were a great fight, sir. Go fuck off. Okay, guys, we're not going down here. That's super dark. Let's see if we can get back up here. Or no. Can we go that way to find where we need to go? Says it's in the Misty Marshes. I think we are going to go down here, guys. I think we are. So that cost us two wake stones, but it was worth it. That was an epic fight. It felt kind of useless a lot of the time. Wow. This place looks crazy. Bloater. These guys explode, so watch out. My attacks hardly do any damage to them, too. He's like got darkness that he casts or something. Is that? Whoa. Dude, holy smokes. What? Damn, guys, do you see that? I just gotta find something that'll heal here because that guy just destroyed me.
Wow. Yeah, you gotta light his ass up. What am I hurt with right now? I don't know, but we can use this to get rid of it. Watch out, he's gonna blow up when he get away. Man. That was really hard and we didn't get any experience from that. How does that work? Over here. What'd you find? Find me to turn a lantern on, don't we? Man. Oh, okay. Well, they know we need our lantern. They're giving us lantern oil. Stability extract. Great. Ah, great, great. No way. Did I just die because of that? Explosive arrow. Man, this place is tough. This place is really tough, guys. Full of tough bosses. Or not tough bosses, but tough enemies. Five hundred experience piece. Scrap iron. We're getting close to our objective, though. We're not going back. We're just gonna keep forging ahead. Good job. You're all right. I got you. I know you got me. This guy's just a bushwhacker. He's sitting over here just whacking at the bush. to get a Over so soon. a weapon buff that I don't have to hurt myself to use. Why like that funeral pyre or that uh, oh, blades of the pyre. It's really cool. But I gotta blow myself up to use it. Oh man, of course. We're gonna fight all these guys now. Watch out. Watch out for Buki. Some of these guys really gotta watch out for, like, that guy with the shield. No! I don't have enough health to be screwing around like that. Let's get Fabuki up, because we need her magic. That mage. This torch, nice. That's what I'm talking about. Bring a little light to this dark world. Let me drop in gold ore, scrap iron. I don't know if I need any more scrap iron, but we'll take it. I could look upon this sky for all eternity. It wasn't for the crook in my neck. Well, this guy's burly. Like you just take him out with your fire magic. Future gold too. No. Six hundred forty experience. Holy cow! Kabuki's got some moves, man. That Superman punch style hit he does really does a lot of damage. Wow. No way. Look at how strong we are. We need to buff our weapons with magic, guys. That's the only way we're going to get through all this. Hmm. 
What's around here? Oh, let's rest at this campfire. Should your pack grow over full, have no fear. Didn't want to talk to you. What I can, want to make camp. You. Could anyone else see that? Or catch it? The light. This, I don't think it's going to turn into daytime, but rest until morning. It's endlessly dark in here. Yeah. So our lantern shuts off, too. That's okay. Everybody light up. Let's see what's on top of this ladder. Scramble. Yes, yes, we like treasure. 4,300 gold, guys. Mine. Holy shit, that's a ton. Mighty Roborant. Fortune has deigned to aid us at last. Cool. 168 experience. You guys just keep knocking them down. Special chest. The Fairy Stone, yes. In case we're in trouble, that's our ticket out of here. We got a couple of those. Who are you? Could you come over here? Such a sick weapon. <laughs> Leafworm skin. Let's see what that bane of bones is all about. It's for a fighter, a mace inscribed with a prayer for the dead to no rest, especially destructive against skeletal fiends. Strike and knockdown power is really good. Cool. We can't use it, but that's a cool weapon. It probably upgrades really well, too. My Asmite. This brother has to be around her, or this guy has to be around her somewhere. Gregor. There's a seeker's token over here. Oh, I missed it. Nope. Our little band has come to feel like a family. Well, would that we could continue our journey together forevermore. <gasps> a time may come when we must. Jeez, uh, stop sliding down everything. You scared me. I was dead. What's up here? I know there's a Seeker's token around here somewhere. Oh! Clipping through the wall. Wow, look at how high up I can climb here, guys. Climb all the way up to the side of the mountain here, basically, where we Don't almost reach daylight. Plentiful hereabouts. Oof. I say we collect as much as we can carry. But that's not the way we want to go. And there's no... I just see a Seeker's token. Nope. Master, if you're carrying around anything you don't need, there's no time like the... How are you falling down the staircase? Of it. 
Let's make haste for the nearest town. I'd rather sell our pickings at market than toss them aside. Yeah, I mean, that's a good idea. You definitely just want to toss crap away. I'm one of those guys in life, I try to save everything I can. You, know, you gotta know what's trash and don't be a hoarder and all that kind of business, but at the same time, things have a lot more uses than you think. Yes, Seeker's Token, that's what we were talking about, guys. Ah, that was worth it. Discovery never gets old. Huh. I'll have to remember to tell my own master about this. Yeah, do it. We have to get to the middle of the lake now, somehow. Oh, come on. It's like knee deep waters. There's like nothing to it. It's knee deep, guys. Okay, we kind of go back towards that little uh, village spot where we found the mace. I don't think we can reach it from here. Ah, material. Useful things, these. Oh, hey. <laughs> Just run into a treasure different chest. combinations of materials result in different creations. Fairy stone. That's sick. There's another fairy stone right there. Um, are they trying to tell me that I kind of got stuck down here? No, I don't think so. I think we can just go out this way. This way, if you please. Oh, there's another token right up here. Look, look. Yes! I'm starting to recognize that symbol. Like, whenever it's a little bit foggy. Nice, we got two Seekers tokens out of that, guys. That was perfect. I love that. Now we'll take the path and continue with the main quest here. Oh, God. It's like we need to come to the rescue. I have no healing items. an ill doer okay oh we got a couple wake stones we'll be okay get up get up These burly guys, I don't know. I don't have any healing items. None of you guys have any healing items. do guys let's put a port crystal down so we can teleport back here can we put a port crystal down I don't know if we can 
I'm gonna try right now. We gotta go get some items and drop some stuff. It was such a long journey out here, it totally depleted us. Damn, we can't use it. Twenty-seven hundred gold. That's good. Here's a secret token. Hey, you guys need to go attack while I just kind of figure out what we gotta do here. Now we can run. Let's see if we get outside of this. You guys go down there and attack him. If I can use my port crystal. No? Really? Because I was attacking? Yeah. The port crystal is set. But we'll have need of Okay, we're going to Fast travel back to Vernworth. And then we can fast travel back to the Misty Marshes here. Because that was gnarly, guys. It's going to take us, like, I don't know. We're going to need some healing items, and we need to, like, adjust our skills and stuff. So let's do that really quick here, because we're still on a time limit for that quest. We'll adjust all our skills that we can, upgrade what we can. Then we're going to go down there and do what do it as many times as it takes. I'm sorry. Come here. Come take a look. You'll be glad you did. Let's enhance our daggers. That's pretty cheap to do. Need a knackered horn. We can enhance our chainmail quite a bit. Oh, we can even go more. We can enhance it all the way. For very cheap, too. Thief skaters. Yeah, why not? 380, that was cheap. 490. You can do his Grievous Horn. His Serpentine Circlet. Yeah, look at all this. See, we needed to come over here and do all this stuff, guys. We're, we're falling behind on all of our upgrades and keeping up. Oh, the Courtly Tunic. Oh, I didn't want to do the Courtly Tunic. That was a mistake. <laughs> Cost a lot of gold for that mistake, too. Huh, okay, anyways. Let's make sure we sell anything we need to sell real quick. Those things are expensive. Must be really good. They're more expensive than wake stones. Just to get rid of this extra weight. Silencing spell. Modest. Mundane. Got a few of these putrid gold twos. They're worth a little bit of money there. Oh, we lost Kabuki? Is that what happened? I don't see Kabuki anywhere. What happened, Kabuki? 900 for the misshapen eye. That's really good. 1200 for the Griffin Pinion. He's got four of them. Always a pleasure. Yeah, there's only two pawns here. The other one got left behind. Damn. Okay, let's buy some items from this guy and then we're going to stick some stuff in storage. Then we're going to go right back there with another pawn. Need anything? Take all your salubrious droughts. Many thanks. Trying to think where else we can buy stuff Shopping like that. Such fun. Not quite understand the desire to buy items purely for the pleasure of owning. Don't pick anywhere. Okay, guys, so? we're gonna go to our house and rest. When we come back, we'll continue on with the episode, or with the next episode of our Let's Play of Dragon's Dogma 2. I'm lucky. The channel's game on. We just keep on gaming on. Thanks for checking us out. We'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.